final boards all done. We got a lot better at our board ripping skills, so we just cranked five boards out really fast today. And uh, we have them all, and our floor is literally halfway down. Pegged down and pegged together, finally. Ten boards. And we're about to snap a chalk line on these edges. And chainsaw these uneven ends off. And we've dragged this large tree out of the woods here that we'd cut down previously. And uh, hopefully we'll get a couple of corner posts, vertical corner posts, uh, cut up today. and. Um, See where we get to. giant corner post. We have a stencil here. This is how the walls are going to be joined to the current corner post and this is kind of experimental as always. Dad's putting a piece of duct tape as a guide for the depth here so he doesn't cut any deeper than two and a half. Any deeper than two and a half inches into this post. And then this thing gets stood up, obviously, and um, we're hoping that in this little thin area it's not going to split, which is kind of a concern, you know. We could go less than two and a half. 
but uh, we'll see what we get. We have lots of pine. <laughs> no shortage of pine, so. No shortage of that stuff. <laughs> First, nearly finished mortise. I'm kind of inclined to We're trying to get it a consistent depth of about two and a half inches. Progress day. We have our first corner post and our second corner post without the channels cut or the mortise cut. 